In the Alpha Complex level, we get one of our hulks imprisoned by the doctors, by the scientists of the lab. So in the next level after that one, we have a zombie testing facility. Solve the test chambers to free the tank. Challenge lab rat. Resolve the optional test chamber. This looks different from everything we have played before in Zombie Night Terror. So let's see how it plays out. I have no idea what to do in here. So let's actually pause and see what we have to do. Apparently we have speeding zombies coming in hot in the danger room number one. We are going to get the overload power up, so... I believe we gotta tell our zombies to go on to the left, the first one that gets the power up. Maybe I can make it in time? Let's see. Okay, now I'm gonna tell this one to tell them to go to the left. And by doing so... I'm also gonna tell them to come down here. To continue straight over here and come down here. I don't know. I guess I have to test it out. Let's see. Nope, this is not gonna be in time to save these guys. So I should probably now tell one of them to go on to the right and another one to go on the left, but this is too many zombies wasted over here. Am I gonna have zombies to reach the final point? Let's see. I guess I only need one to reach that point. Um, you wanna go to the right? Let's see, this is gonna be a trial and error thing. I have no idea what should we do over here? Nah, we can't do it this way. We need another zombie to step on that platform, right? This guy's gonna kill himself on the laser, but how are we gonna prevent them from doing this? Hold up. Oh, there's more coming! There's more coming, so I guess what I'll have to do over here is... Hold up, they only give me a limited number of zombies, so if I do this, they will probably not give me another one. Or will they? No, something changed over here. I don't need this overload over here. I think when I click on this button over here, this platform went up, which allows me to use one less overload to do this in the end. So, hold up. Now I'm gonna do this. Prevent them from continuing. Oh god, that, that destroyed the zombie, but at the same time, the button is still pressed. So, hold up. Now we have access to that power-up. Which we want. So I'm gonna let things go. Okay. Oh, hold up! Uh, my mistake! So let's destroy him. Oh, hold up. Hold up. This means that I need the Overlord here again. But it's fine, because now we have two zombies available. I can make one an Overlord, and the other one will continue down straight. Alright! Test 1 is okay. Moving on to Danger Room 2 for the Cognitive Test. I'm helping my zombies to go through the tests of these humans. That doesn't feel right. I guess I'll do this for now. This guy's gonna continue. I hope they send me another subject if I burn this one. I think that's gonna happen, so... We're cool on that. Oh! Okay, at least we don't need to keep him over there. Let's wait for this guy to fall down here, and then I'm gonna burn this overlord. Because I might need him over there, right? I don't, apparently? Okay. Alright. So, let's keep this guy over here and tell him to go forward. How am I gonna reach that button over there? I need a stalker somewhere over here. Don't I? That's why I have the stalker power up now. This guy's gonna die. How do I reach that power up over there? The door is still closed. I cannot activate that button, can I? I can't reach it right now. Do I have to restart this? Do I need to have this button and this one active? I think that's it. And now I've jinxed it. Maybe I just need to disable this button now? Let's see. Okay, so hold up. I don't need this guy over here either, so let this guy come down. I'm gonna put an overload over here and tell him to tell the others to go forward. 
Now I'm gonna burn this guy. Like so. This guy is now in the prison. Is enclosed over there. I'm gonna stop this guy so that this one goes back. There we go. Do not press the button, please. Awesome. Okay. Now that is open. Nice. I didn't really have to restart this. That was my mistake. Not to mention when you restart things, you go to the challenge number one again. Let's see what happens now. Okay. Oh, damn. Alright, so hold up. You come down. I need to have one to stay here. Like so, so that this guy continues forward. Like this. Now, I need to destroy this guy. Okay, cool. Now I need the, the door open again. But only when these guys are ready to go forward. So, hold up. I need one to become an overlord over here. Like you. So, this will be somewhat either lucky or very unlucky. I just need this door open. Let's see. The timing might not be perfect. It is. It is because of my overlord over there. We'll tell him to go back. So, that's good. Nice. So, now let's burn this guy. And he should be able to go forward. There we go. Cognitive test surpassed. Let's see what happens now. Okay. A stalker over here. We'll do... Great things, right? You're gonna go up. And then over here. Is this part of the test? I don't think so. This must be something else. This is already me as a zombie lord thinking. Alright, he's trapped over there now. Let's see. Danger room number three. That button will be pressed. Let's see what happens. Huh. Let's tell him to go down here and see what happens then. That guy is completely trapped over there now. I don't know exactly what changed. Let's see what happens when I bring them over here. Oh, okay. We need a stalker over here to go through this vent. All right. This door closed. Let's see. So I'm going to tell them to go up here. The effect of that button remained, right? I hope so. So let's see. I'm going to make this guy a stalker as well. And I'm gonna tell them to come up here. They will destroy this machine and this will open this door over here, hopefully. Something like that. Let's see. Oh god, they will not go down now. Okay, so let's destroy one of them so that they send me a new zombie. Okay, we're gonna continue over here. And you're gonna become a stalker and go up there. Nice. Okay, destroy that machine and this will allow this friend of yours. Or maybe you will just open this door and allow him to come down here and destroy this machine. I have no idea. So, let's have one zombie go down there. Let's speed up things. Okay, and now we're gonna become a stalker. Let's tell him to go straight forward over here. Okay, nice. Now that guy needs to continue. But the door will close, right? Okay, it seems to close, but only after a few seconds, which gives this time, this guy time to go up there. Wow, this must be timed perfectly, doesn't it? I don't have the jump power up. Oh my god, he got up there, how? He's gonna kill himself! That's not great, I didn't see that door over there. Oh god, I'll have to do this all over again. Yes, good, now let's see what happens over here. That door closed. Okay, he's gonna go up there and destroy this machine. Probably to take this laser out. And that's a good thing. So keep doing what you're doing. Oh god, this door is closed. How so? Aha! Go up there. And destroy this machine. Perfect. Now, finally, I need a last zombie. I'm gonna burn this baby of mine. Need the last one to go up there and destroy that machine over there. Alright, what's the optional challenge over here? There is a optional challenge which, which will give me the brain badge, but I have no idea where it is. Okay, all of those zombies are gone. There's not much I can do with them. Oh, oh, hold up. Is this the... What is this doing? They got electrified. Oh god, that's... This one got electrified as well. 
That's not a good thing. That was my only zombie coming to this side. How am I gonna get another one over here? Hold up. Let me think about this. You continue forward. Okay, they both got electrified. So, keep going up. And you go straight. Okay. Alright. Oh, hold up. Another one spawned over here. Have no idea why, but this seems to be the right order. Let's see. Let's change this one around now. And let's leave that one as it is. No. This is not the course of things, so I need to go up, right? And this guy needs to continue forward. So, one, two... Let's see. Let's go up here. Definitely. One, two, three. Let's see if that's the one. Doesn't seem to be the one. 20 minutes later. What the heck? I don't... Let's try... This? One, two, three. Oh, nice. One, two, three. Let's see if that's the fourth one. Nope. All right. So we figured it out one thing more. So one, two, three. You go over there. And this guy needs to go forward, I suppose. No. That's not the answer. One, two, three. This is going to take a while. <laughs> I am terrible at this. My brain is exploding. Okay, you are gonna do what? I don't even know anymore. I've tried that and I've tried that. We should try that one over there. What happens if I do this? They're gonna bring me a new one, right? This one is not, not the answer either. Maybe this one then? Let's see, okay. Let's try this one now. And you have to stop over there. Let's see. Okay, nice! So one, two, three, four. Oh my god, what now? What do I do now? Let's stop this guy over here. And let's see what's the answer now. It's a matter of... Trial and error, so we're gonna go over there. Ah! Okay, so it must be that one over there. Oh, God, this is gonna take a while. One, two, you jump over there. No! <gasps> no! One hour later. <laughs> Perfect, please let this be the answer. Please? Yes! Okay, now what? It's either up or down. Hopefully it's up. Let's see. Please, let it be up. No! <laughs> uh, frag puzzle games. Uh, Three hours later. Can you move it along? I'm all out of time cards. You are gonna get that one. Nice! This should be the answer. Alright, now you stay over there. You get burned. I'm gonna get that button, and finally, that one over there. Let's burn this guy as well. And we should be good to go. Whew. This took a while, but I did it. And I'm taking more time because I'm a dumby. Let's wait for this guy to get that button. Wow, I don't even know what's the answer anymore. So, it was... One, two, three... Four... I don't even know anymore. Watch back the video and get to know it, because I can't remember it. I would have to go back and see what's the answer. Alright, so finally we're out of there. Hold up, though. The electricity is still over here. Is this the optional badge thingy? I think it is. Oh my god, I could have always do this. And I would be good. Well, at least the optional one is done. Oh, goody! It's time for something. For the record, this test has killed two... 145 monkeys and something, maybe rats or sparrows. Oh, what the? Okay. Okay, I have some zombies coming from the sides. I need to reach that point, apparently. What am I gonna do over here with the robots, though? If I try to reach that point over there in the laser, 
he's gonna get burned, right? Oh, I, I did click it for a, a second, a split second, though. Let's see, can I do that again? One, and two. No, can they destroy these robots? Let's see. Because there's really no limit in zombies. I can always do this. And I can always burn more zombies for more DNA. Yeah, they can destroy the robots. All right, destroy that machine over there. And let's see what happens. Oh. Now let's do some physics. I call this one the Sisyphus because I am a very educated person. Bring remaining test subjects to danger room number five. Okay, I didn't really did much back there though. I just destroyed a couple of robots. I think I failed on that test, but hey. All right, what now? Physics test, you said? Oh, oh, hi, down here. How are you? Let's see. Oh, okay. So, basically, I need this to reach the final point, which is over here, to explode something. Alright, so... Let's stop these guys over here and try to understand what exactly do these buttons do. Alright. Okay, they do exactly nothing if you obviously keep them both off. So, let's turn one on. Oh, I see! They're changing the direction of the gust of wind. So basically, I want to go up, yes, and I want to go to the left. So up is what we want right now. And then I want to go to the left. No, that's not it. I want to go to the left. That's exactly it. And we want to keep going up and then to the right. Yes, that's correct. Let's leave the zombie to do that. Do we want to press that button? We just did, I suppose. Um, now we want to go down, so... Hold up a second, though. This is gonna push the thingy to the left. Oh, hold up. Now we want to go down. I suppose we can do that. I'm gonna stop this guy. And I'm gonna let the new zombie on this side to go down. Let's see. No, not up, but down, please. Uh... Is it stuck? Because it's not working. Hold up. I'm gonna do this. And I want to burn this guy so that maybe by leading to the right. There we go. We can get it unstuck. Alright. We want to get it unstuck again. Hold up. Let's keep having it to the right. And then now we need to go with the wind of gust up. Oh, there we go. Yeah. Continue. Straight. And now. Awesome. Now hold up. This is a tricky part. Um, let's stop them both. Okay, now... We need to go up and to the left at the same time. So... I'm gonna stop this guy. And I'm gonna have them... Over here, on this side. Like so. Now we need to... Go up with the wind. So let's burn this guy. It's gonna go to the left, which will lead them. Nice! Okay. Now on to the right again. This is giving me some work. So let's see, let's burn this guy. And it's confusing my brain as well. I don't usually play games that break my brain this way. Because then I will not have a brain at the end of the day. So yeah. Alright, this is good, this is bueno. Oh, that was too much. That was too much, hold up. Okay, okay, this is this is doing it. This is doing it. We don't need the wind to go on down. We need it to go up now again. Oh, okay, now we need to go to the left again. So I should probably stop this guy over here. And this one needs to go on to the left. And to the right again. So we can just make him go freely. Like so. Now we need the wind once again down. <laughs> Wow, emotional. Very emotional times, oh my god. I need it, needed the wind to go on to the right. And that's gonna happen now, I suppose. I need the wind to go up, though. Okay, you stay there. Stay put. Alright, now you go up. Oh my god, that was too much. Please go on to the right, please. Ah, didn't quite work. But maybe it will work now. Nice, okay. Good, we got this power up. You guys, stay over there. Do nothing. Alright, nice. We got the screen power up 
done with. Oh, hold up. Is this where I'm going to release the beastie? Okay, what happens if I do this? <laughs> Big baby incoming! Uh, I don't have the speed power up or anything like that. I don't want this guy to die. Is he good? Oh my god, I gotta, gotta make him jump. I better. Okay, good, 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 good. I feel I needed that, or the guy would probably die. He was taking too many shots. We got the tank! And we got the badge, right? Yes! I got the breaking your brain badge because of that challenge, that optional challenge. Let's see what's gonna go happen next. And strange English. Let's see what's happen next on the next level. But eventually we will leave it for the next video. Hi there, I am Al, the AI interface of this facility. It's a pleasure to meet you. You are entering a secure zone. Please state your identity. Identity unknown. Punching the door is futile. Please seek anger concealing. Counseling. Identity unknown. I'm terribly sorry, but all attempts have failed to find a matching profile in the database. Intruder management protocol number five engaged. Have a pleasant day. Well, that's not great. They keep coming with these defenses. They're gonna become zombies, right? They're gonna become infected or something. Wreck havoc in the laboratory by killing 16 humans. With what? We just lost all our zombies there. I guess we're gonna find out on the next video. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you so much for watching this one. My name has been Disparage and you have a grand day. Until then, bye-bye.